When I wanted to learn game development, I had no idea where to start. I was watching so many videos with different approaches and tutorials were really complex. I felt so stupid and I almost gave up. If you're feeling like this, like I once did, then hopefully these three steps I'm about to share with you will get you going on your very own game development journey. Step one, pick a game engine. Now there are so many game engines out there from Unreal, Unity, Game Maker, Godot or Godot. Is it Godot? I have no idea. And many, many more. Now let's just say for whatever reason, you decided to choose Unity. <laughs> Don't spend money on courses, okay? Not yet at least. Not like me. I bought so many of these Udemy courses and now I'm a library. Go to this site, unity.learn and do this course. This course, if you haven't seen it in my previous video, is amazing. <laughs> Unlike you, I did buy loads of courses and didn't know Unity did their own extensive courses for free. Step two, you've chosen a game engine under no influence whatsoever, okay? <laughs> and an amazing course to go with it. Now all we need is consistency. Now you could make a calendar, I'm making GTA on Monday and Fortnite on Wednesday. No, do a 100 day game dev challenge. Okay, 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 don't get scared. All you need to do is pledge 30 minutes to an hour a day doing the course and showing your progress. For example, I started the Creative Code course on Unity today and got to grips with the Unity interface. I'm excited to start my journey of making amazing games that put smiles on people's faces, including my dog. Hashtag 100 days of game dev. Hashtag game dev. Hashtag you only live once. Hashtag I don't know how to code, but I'm about to start. So please send help. Don't forget to bring the pizza. Step three, practice. This course has bonus features that would create challenges for yourself and embeds what you have done previously into if your statements. brain. Variables, functions, unity, pizza, 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 pizza. So if you're feeling really invested, then go for a harder challenge and make something new, but within your current skill set. The best way to do this is to write down what you can currently do right now in unity and then put it to practice. If you want to see my game development journey using these three steps, then check this video. Good luck, and if you do take on the course, feel free to let me know how you are getting on on Twitter. I'd love to see your progress. Bye bye.